This video app review is brought to you by the iPhoneAppReview.com. What's up, everybody? This is Luke Patrick at the iPhoneAppReview.com. Today we're singing out yet another video review, this time taking a look at an application uh, called Mobile Link Cam that I have right here, Mobile Link, um, and it is booted up and ready to go. So let's go ahead and pop it open and show you how things are. Um, it is night, so these cameras are going to be dark, but it shouldn't matter. We're going to show you the full functionality anyway. So what exactly does this application entail? Well, basically it allows you to connect to any of your IP cameras via your iPhone and then use them to their full, uh, fullest potential, so to speak. So for instance, let's go ahead and tap camera one that's set up to look at a backyard. Uh, and that is actually pretty hard to see, uh, but uh, we'll, we'll show you another in a second that looks better. Um, I apologize, I should have uh, done this earlier in the day actually. Um, but you can see a palm tree up there, uh, and this is, of course, the backyard. You can hear it is receiving. You can turn off audio simply by tapping that. Uh, you can also take a picture if you would like, so there's that as well. Um, let's go ahead and go to the garage, and then this is really cool. I appreciate this a lot. So there's a car, um, obviously. Let me bring this in just a little bit closer. And uh, this is a camera, um, so here's how it works. Basically, you can drag this around. If you have a camera that's enabled to do this, there is no reason in the world why you cannot use your uh, built-in functionality to adjust the camera's yaw, pitch, and tilt um, to have a look around. So there we are looking at vehicle one, and uh, with a little twisting and twerking over, we can look at vehicle two, etc., etc. <laughs> and this is all for my iPhone. I have to admit, this is really cool. Um, I like it a lot, actually. It's very, very entertaining, which is not something that I expected out of this review. Also kind of makes me feel like James Bond, um, so that's really interesting and cool. Uh, how far up can we go? Hey, that's pretty cool. Hey. Sorry, I guess I hadn't played fully with this. Um, a lot of rotation happening. Um, so that's how this works. Um, let's go ahead and go back, and of course you have the same uh, sound and photo options there, and those are live, they will just hang out, and I can go back at any point in time to check them out. Um, you have a couple different options here, you can send and receive as well, uh, send and receive for settings, prevent sleep if you would like, so you can just have this going all the time. Uh, you have all cameras, you can also add new camera, so I'm going to go ahead and show you how this goes, you can add a camera or collection. Um, new camera, basically you go in, you can type a name, I'm just going to leave new camera, camera type, Here's every single available IP camera on the market as far as I can tell. Uh, granted, I'm no expert, uh, but if you flip through, you see Wowie, webcams, um, all sorts of different um, Logitechs, blah, blah, blah. All of these are in here. Um, all the name brands, all of the recognizable brands, Canon, uh, Cisco. Uh, of course, if you're more into this than I am, you might know a few more of these, uh, but anyway. That is everything you could possibly want in terms of camera uh, support. And of course, you get the full functionality as mentioned as well. Very simple to set up too. You simply add the IP address, which you should already have since it's an IP camera. The port number, usually the same port number. Uh, and then your username and password if it's there. And use HTTPS if you would like to keep it secure. And then vertical camera adjustments, horizontal camera adjustments. Then uh, basically, you could skip a lot of this and then simply hit save. Simply by entering your IP. If it's not protected, fine, whatever. You hit go. And then uh, a few seconds later, you get a camera. So, of course, that's not connected to anything, but it is a new camera. So, that is pretty much uh, how the application works. And, you know, I guess showing it at night isn't a bad idea, too, because this shows you exactly uh, what you might get out of, um, say, this application at night when you might be in a hotel suite thousands of miles away. Uh, and you just want to check out and make sure that your home is okay. Um, I suppose that's actually not a bad thing to show. Uh, so, anyway, take it as it may be. So there's that, and that is pretty much the application. Um, we think it is phenomenal. It is a bit pricey at $4.99, but then again, if you've gone to the effort to actually set up um, an IP camera, then uh, you, you probably don't mind paying an extra 5 bucks to play with this stuff from your iPhone or actually use it um, in a very, very secure and very professional sort of way. Like I mentioned, being uh, in a hotel room that's 1,000 miles away from your house, I and mean, watching your house to make sure everything's okay, or uh, optionally, I have pets. Sometimes I set up my laptop on a table when I'm gone so I can watch the house and see what the pets are doing in case someone's not there to take care of them at the time. Uh, or, I mean, I have someone to take care of them, but you know what I mean, before they're there. Um, 
And so this would do that as well. If you, and again, just as long as you have an IP camera, you are set up to go and you can use the app almost immediately. It takes very little effort to set up uh, and it works fabulously. So there is that. That's pretty much it. We're going to give uh, Mobile Link Cam a solid 5 out of 5 star rating from us. Our only uh, real niggle with the application is its price. And other than that, it's phenomenal. It's very easy to use and it supports everything. So it's hard to argue with. All right, that's it from us. And at this point, I'm going to go ahead and sign out, but we will see you guys later.